Hey guys, this is Enzo here. This is week four about hot fuel handling, and I wanna to talk to you about the importance of choosing the right filter for your application. When it comes to picking the right filter for your engine, you wanna make sure that your filter is sized adequately for your pump, not for the engine horsepower. You wanna make sure that that pump can handle the entire amount of fuel that your fuel pump is capable of. Commonly, you want to put a 100 micron stainless mesh element before your fuel pump and a 10 micron either cellulose media or microglass, depending on your fuel, after your pump. But keep in mind, it needs to be sized accordingly for your pump. Let's use, for example, our five gallon per minute pump. It, of course, pumps five gallons per minute every minute. So it is recirculating that much fuel. If your filter is not adequately sized to handle that much fuel, it will create a restriction in your fuel system. That restriction is gonna create cavitation and the overall concept of hot fuel issues. When it comes to the filtration micron rating, it's not so much just it's 10 micron, it's also the surface area of the actual media itself. For example, this is a 10 micron rated element for a competitor. This is a 10 micron element for ours as well. This is basically one square inch of material. This is 60 square inches of material. Which do you think flows more? If you look at the competitors versus our 10 micron, the size isn't much difference, but it's the inside, the part that matters that's what counts. Another consideration for when you're plumbing your system with your filtration is also to keep in mind to have the adequate size fittings in tandem with your filter. Like for this, a 10 ORB to 10 AN flare for your 10 ORB filter to limit the chance of any restriction there might be in your system, which as you know, can cause hot fuel problems. An example of a filter we offer for like bread and butter applications from an N-Tank 340 pump up to an A1000 inline pump is our 10 ORB filter. Another example of something that guys would want to use on more of a factory based application, something where you would use like a drop in 340 pump or a phantom kit or even a Gen 2 tank. You would use something like the AN fittings that are already part of the housing, which, as you can see from this cutaway, do not sacrifice flow with the chamfered edge that helps with added flow of your fuel with less restriction. For our bigger fuel pumps, like an Eliminator up to a Pro Series, in some cases a three and a half, maybe a smaller mechanical pump, we would use something like our commonly referred to Pro Series filter with 12 ORB inlet and outlet ports. For the customers with the larger fuel pumps, like the three and a half, the five gallon per minute, the seven, the 10 gallon per minute, even some of the large mechanical pumps up to 32 gallons per minute, you would wanna look at something like our 16 ORB inline filter with 16 ORB inlet and outlet ports available in the common micron rating sizes of 10, 40, and 100. When it comes to filtration, we like to use the mantra that a filter is a good insurance policy for your investment of a fuel pump. You want to make sure you have adequate flow for the money you have invested in your quality aeromotive fuel pump. For example, like our inline filters, you wouldn't want to spend pennies on a cheap insurance policy to protect your investment. You would want to buy a quality unit, spend the extra couple bucks, get yourself a better unit, protect your filters, and protect your fuel pump with a quality aeromotive filtration with our better service area, media, and quality design.